I am going to try something new today. I just got this leaky cup in the mail not too long ago. I tried pouring it over top of a vase. It turned out okay. It wasn't my favorite, but it looked pretty cool. I'm going to try to do it right onto a canvas today. So I'm going to go ahead and use a couple different uh, pouring paints today. So I have some from Arteza, Art, De Art Deco Art, Mixed Media Girl, and those you can all mix together. The Artist Loft, you cannot mix with anything else but Artist Loft paint. So uh, what you basically do is, um, like, like I said, it's a leaky cup, so it has holes all around. So I don't know if you can see like the holes around there. So I'm just going to place it onto the canvas. And you're just going to go ahead and pour through the cup and it's going to pour onto the canvas itself. And it's almost going to give you like a little bit of a feeling of like you're pouring through a vase or some sort of um, other uh, material that you're pouring on top of to give you that different look. So I'm going to go ahead and start with my Arteza paint. So this is Playful Pink. You want to try to get it through the holes. And try to make it as even as possible. And this is Ocean Blue, again, Orteza. And this is, I'm going to go with some Echo, Deco Art uh, Liquid Gold here. And this is also Deco Art, and this is um, Purple Neon. And this is a 14 by 14 canvas, so I'm actually going to need quite a bit of paint here. This is Mixed Media Girl. This is Electric Pink. This is... Arteza Lustrous Black. This is Mixed Media Girl Lavender Shimmer. Basically you want to put the colors on top so that way the other colors pour out. This is Mixed Media Girl Fairy Spit. Okay, this is Mix Me A Girl Flamingo Shimmer. You can kind of see how it's giving you those lines there. Let's see if I can get. Sometimes with the deco art, you get these little stringy things, and I'm not sure why. I don't know if it's because it's a cheaper paint. But it's starting to give you a little bit like a petal look which is pretty cool. This is just Mixed Media Girl White. This is Rare Jade Green from Arteza. Robin's Egg Blue from Mixed Media Girl. And some Royal Purple. Also Mixed Media Girl. This is Rose Gold from uh, Echo Dark. 
deco art. Blah, sorry. And of course that one's not open. So I'll go ahead and use this one, which should be already open. And I think that is pretty much all the colors I have picked out. So I just have some mixed media girl black here, which I can put in there. But that should be enough paint. And what I think I'm going to do, since it's kind of reminded me of petals a little bit, is lift that up. And I think I'm going to go ahead and make some lines. So I'm going to kind of rack it a little bit. And it's already got some cells going in there. That's pretty cool. And now we tilt. I'm just trying to keep some of those lacing and some of those cells in here. And you'll see some more cells pop up as we go along. I probably should have put this on a cake turner and spun it out. That probably would have left the design in there better. But since I'm stretching it out using just a tilting way, it's going to not look quite like flower petals, which is fine because it can give you a completely different look and still look really cool. I just want to make sure you get all your edges. I think I'm going to try to make this a little bit more of a darker piece and get rid of some of that extra green that I have on the edge here. and tilt it and see if I can get some more of that black down in that far corner. I just love watching this paint move. It just so relaxes me. Hopefully it relaxes everybody as well that's watching. Again, you just want to make sure you get all your corners and make sure they all have paint on them. Ooh, that's, that corner's coming out really cool because all the lacing and the cells on it. Oh, I hope I can save it. I will definitely take a picture of it when I'm finally done. I hope you, everybody enjoys. Oh, I don't want to get rid of it too much. I hope everybody enjoyed this. And I, like I said, I will definitely take a picture, but I'm like so excited with that corner down there with all the cells. That looks like it's just about out of time. I hope you all have a wonderful day and enjoy your painting.